Now, what is your personal philosophy behind your particular spiritual path? Our personal philosophy is very simple. Divine love, divine devotion, and divine surrender. Unlike the human love, human devotion, and human surrender. How does that affect decisions you make in everyday living? It affects at every moment. When you offer divine love, we do not expect anything from others in return. We just love because we feel that inside that person is the living a reality which you call the supreme. And when we devote ourselves divinely to an individual, we feel that we are reaching the source within us. And then when we make a divine surrender, we feel that our unlit part has surrendered to the most illumined part within us. It is not the surrender of a slave to the master, but it is the surrender of one's unlit reality to the most illumined reality within him. Yes, in our path, when we surrender our will to the source, we feel that the Supreme within us will guide us, guide us, mold us, shape us according to his own inner uh, will. Can you describe what you do? I give talks and I answer questions and also I teach my students, my disciples all over the world to how to meditate and I have written, as you know, uh, considerably and also I help them inwardly. Um, God, out of his infinite bounty, has given me the capacity to communicate with the souls of the seekers. So I teach the soul of the individual how to convince the aspiring heart and the searching mind to pray and meditate. So I mostly deal with the souls. When the souls deal with the individuals, I feel it is most effective.